To start, let's talk about how to weigh anything. To measure weight, you're going to need a scale. When you come to your scale, press the on button and wait until you see a zero. Then place the object that you want to weigh on the tray. The spoon weighs 4.1 grams. If you're weighing something solid, like a spoon or a crystal, this is a pretty simple process. But what if you want to measure something that's a little bit harder to measure? Like maybe these beads. I could put the cup of beads on there. The problem is that the cup has its own weight. So how do I separate the weight of the cup and the beads? Okay, maybe that wasn't the best idea. Okay, let's try that again. But this time, let's put the cup on first. The cup weighs 10.5 grams. If I then add the beads, together they weigh 51.9 grams. So if I take away the 10.5 grams from 51.9 grams, I get 41.4 grams, and that is the weight of the beads. I can do this another way too. First I can put the cup on the scale, press the on button which also says zero, and that will return the scale to zero. So now it's considering the cup a part of the scale. And there I have 41.5 grams of beads. Let's try that again, but this time with sugar. My lab calls for five grams of sugar. So I place the cup on the tray, zero the scale, and then begin to add sugar. I'm going to add a little bit at a time. Oh dear, I've passed it, so I need to take a little bit out. Very, very close. And now I have five grams of sugar. This strategy also works for liquids and anything else that you can't put directly on the tray of the scale. And that is how to weigh liquid and other messy stuff.